welcome to our on our channel where we make structural engineering design simple and easy my name is Olodu Konyedi and I want to appreciate everyone that has subscribed to our channel those who are sending comments those who are asking questions we appreciate you we appreciate you and those who are still yet to subscribe to our channel please hit the subscribe button you can like this video you can share this video we will be glad to know that you have subscribed to our channel we had a lot of questions from our subscribers and we want to say we appreciate that and we have a very very exciting news that our online course is finally ready the link will be posted at the description section so hit that link go get the course it is very educative and explanatory detailed breakdown on the step-by-step -step guide to reinforce concrete design using proto structure that is the title of the course that we just finished there are other course still in the pipeline where we are still working on but this is that please go get it it is very very inspiratory and very educative so thank you very much we will be taking some of your questions today we had a subscriber Juhari act, actor type he has a Joe J asked he said something and I want to reply that Joe I miss J I mistakenly called your country Malawi instead of Malaysia Kuala Lumpur Malaysia I am very very sorry for that mix up I'm very sorry for that mix up you chatted me up from Malaysia I mistakenly said Malawi I am sorry for that and I think I am making my corrections now I'm making my corrections now so I really appreciate I really appreciate you for calling that mistake that I've done so I appreciate that so sorry for the miss up you chatted me up from Kuala Lumpur Malaysia not Malawi thank you you further asked that your question also said I've tried this uh, that this way does not satisfy the architectural layout how can we use only the existing middle column without adding another column you also said we want to avoid having two additional columns thank you you are my guru thank you I appreciate you you further said this will affect the architectural plan this you you, you went on to say this is my other email because I am on another computer so thank you you said you need the three separate spans sir. yes a three separate span so what would do um, Johari what we'll do is on the description section I'll place in my email address please what you what you are trying to explain to me let's assume this is what you are explaining circle the area you want because your question said how can you change a three span continuous beam to a simply support beam 
what I will want, I will place my email address at that description section. What you are trying to explain to me, I convert that your drawing to a PDF. To a PDF file and circle the area you want me to look at. Circle it and send to my email. Let me see what exactly you are asking for. I think that would really help me. I think that would help me. So on the description menu, I will I will be putting an my email address where you can send that to me and I can really appreciate what you are trying to communicate to me. So I want to say a big thank you once again to Johari Archetype Archetype from Malaysia from Malaysia not Malawi thank you very very much thank you very much we have um, Putasio put, put, Putasio Putarax Putaraxa you said thank you I appreciate you I appreciate you very much and Obona Chukuma your comment says what is the issue with your audio on ba or the background sound I think what you are talking about was the sound at the background from one of our videos that sound was the rain I I walk late into the night and I had to do that video and then it was raining very heavy so there's nothing we can do with that sound but I apologize for that sound at the background it was caused by the rain the rain fell very heavy on that day and we have to put out the video so we had to do it while it was raining so my apologies please for that sound we will work out to get better sound next time okay uh, I think we are having some of our subscribers from Russia your comments are in Russia if I if I'm not mistaken please if you can translate what you've put out if you can translate it we will really really appreciate it we will really really appreciate it and once again all those from Russia or from the Russia Russia less I appreciate it even if even though I can't um, seem to translate what you are saying but all the same I appreciate you we have um, this comment from one of our subscriber Gasan, ga Gasan, Gasan. You said I have problem with section is sufficient for share. How can I let the software distribute share links automatically? Ga Gashan, you are asking if you have a problem with the section. So in terms of this the first thing if i understand your question very well the first thing i will do is to go to my settings go to beam story this uh, beam design and i'll click this if you are having problem with your section The first thing I will come parameter this maximum space span link spacing is 25. I will reduce it to two. Uh, to, uh, it was 250. I will reduce it to 200. All this I will reduce them to 200. So the computer automatically works with 200. 
I we click save, um, save. That is the first thing I will do if I'm having that issue. And when you you I run my analysis, if anything has changed, I will run the analysis. So that's the first thing I will do. I will first of all che check my settings, then I run, okay, let's say I run the analysis. I run my analysis. I run my analysis. That is what I will do. Okay, it has finished the analysis. We'll close here. Let's go over to this. So this, uh, if, if it's showing you this mark, it means there's an error somewhere. So you click on this. You click on this. This is it. Okay, you you were asking if your share link is not um, if it's giving you um, insufficient if it's giving you insufficient for share section section insufficient for share. What you do? What you do is double click on it. If you look on this red, it means the share, the share link spacing is not enough. Is not enough. So what you can do is you click on this. You see section insufficient share this is what it will tell you so come to this arrow at the back reduce it do not click on this update just click on the next one so you see is now um, showing you black meaning it's okay now it's okay click is okay so this is how this is how you solve that problem this is how you solve the problem you click and you solve that problem and this is it this is it hmm. this is how you do it just click on the next one by reducing it this is it but if you are having something like this okay let's let's see this good let's assume you are having the bars not sufficient and it's giving you this right here not this part here this bottom part is for the share links this is for links why this is for the main reinforcement this is for the main reinforcement that other one is for the link but this is for the main reinforcement. So what you do is two ways. If you click on this front, you either re you reduce the numbers of the bar, or you can increase it by clicking up here, or you can in reduce the diameter or increase the diameter. So depending on which one can solve it, that is what you do so with this you can solve any reinforcement issues
on pro especially on the beam reinforcement issues of the beam on proto either by working on the links or by working on the main bar reinforcement so this is how you solve that problem but a uh, uh, gas gasian if you still have any issue please let us know please let us know and we will be glad to respond to you we will be glad to respond to you so like what i said before our online course is out it will be on the description section please click the link go get the course and also if you've not subscribed to our channel please hit that subscribe button god bless you bye